If we're serious about paying down the deficit, the savings we achieve from tax reform should be used to pay down the deficit and potentially to make our businesses more competitive. Now, I think this balanced mix of spending cuts and tax reform is the best way to finish the job of deficit reduction. The overwhelming majority of the American people, Democrats and Republicans, as well as independents, have the same view. And both the House and the Senate are working towards budget proposals that I hope reflect this balanced approach. Uh, having said that, I know that a full budget may not be finished before March 1st. Uh, and unfortunately, that's the date when a series of harmful automatic cuts to job-creating investments in defense spending, uh, also known as the sequester, are scheduled to take effect. So if Congress can't act immediately on a bigger package, if they can't get a bigger package done by the time the sequester is scheduled to go into effect, then I believe that they should at least pass a smaller package of spending cuts and tax reforms that would delay the economically damaging effects of the sequester for a few more months until Congress finds a way to replace these cuts with a smarter solution.